After it! Hey! Gotta save my strength a bit. No telling how long we're gonna need to keep running. Geralt, we gotta have a man to horse talk. No offense, but your riding skills, they leave a bit to be desired, buddy. You'd really do me a solid if you could uh, apply a slightly surer hand, be a little more decisive about where you want me to go. <sighs> Sometimes I got no idea, buddy. Do I go left, right, toward where I'm standing? Yeah, and it'd be great if you could respond more fluidly to my commands. Hey, heard this one? Horse walks into a tavern, and the innkeeper says, Hey, pal, why the long face? Ha! <laughs> Let's not lose sight of that umbra. Can you see it now? Yeah, it's right there. Run, Roach. What the fuck do you think I'm doing? <laughs> I've heard. Don't recall that ever happening. Of course you don't. <gasps> Melted into thin air. Some kind of glowy magic thing going on with this tombstone. We should check it out. Marcello Clerici, knight. Died last year. Was more or less the same age as our hermit. Seems his spirit's become a horse-shaped umbra that's tormenting Panastri. Why are you telling me this? I can read and draw my own conclusions. Thinking aloud, that's all. Helps me focus. Geralt! It's the Umbra! Attack! Let me explain! Talk, but make it fast. Why are you tormenting the Hermit? She torments me! Refuses to forgive me! I'm denied peace in the afterlife, and it's all her doing! Each day I come and beg her for clemency. Beg her for clemency? You drink her blood, drive her mad with fear. I don't know how to explain it, but yes! A monstrous form. You and the Hermit. Have... We met as babes, grew up side by side. I... I loved her. Yet she was always sad, nothing could cheer her. The world terrified her. I thought her gloom came from being poor, so I did my damnness to take us from our village, make us a better life elsewhere. 
became a squire, took her with me to the palace. But Panastri soon learned nobles are no more decent than peasants, not a speck. Once even I'd grown vile to her eyes, she fled the palace and joined the flagellants. I left the court to be near her, yet she cast me off, said she didn't want to know me. When the whip bearers proved too hard-hearted for her too, she became a hermit. I see it clearly now, though I never understood her while alive. From the grave's dark depth, the living are bright, sharp flares. You see all their thoughts at once? Now I understand why she had to cast me off. Hmm. She's full of rage. Probably what turned you into an Umbra. Why take the form of a horse? A horse? What do you mean? Each day since I died, a power lifts me from my grave and, and makes me run. Then I return with blood in my mouth. I don't know what this is, how it comes to pass, but I do know the torment will continue until she forgives me. But she sees me as a horse, you say? Seems so. Same way I saw you. Must have hurt her something awful if she refused. To her? Nothing. But my horse, I... I, I flogged it to death. Pinastri, she saw this. Proud stallion, my blaze. But he was a bucker and tossed me during a tourney. One I'd wanted to win badly. Pinastri had been so glad they'd let me stand. Me, a peasant's son. I wanted to win it for her. But that horse made me loose. Rage overcame me. I struck and struck until at last he fell. Oh, the regret. I beg you, forgive me. Absolve me in Blaze's very name. Can't forgive you for that. Not in my power. But your horse could? Please, I'd do anything. I'm desperate. Help me. Noble Mare, forgive me my sin! Anyone who flogs a horse to death on account of some silly tourney deserves a fate this bad. Let's kick his astral ass, Geralt. For plays! Poor hermit. Won't let you torment her again. I did what I had to do. Right. Agreed. Let's head back to the Hermits. Drove off the Phantom, but it'll be back sooner or later. It'll keep coming till you forgive Marcello his deed. It's his specter that torments you. I will never forgive him. Never. Petty rage drove him to torture that innocent beast to death. He's an evil man who deserves no mercy. He'll never let you rest if you don't forgive him. I cannot forgive him. He'll get no pardon from me. If I too must suffer for his sin, so be it. 
such is my fate. Yet still I thank you for your help. Knowing the course grants me some respite. There's that at least. As agreed, take this for your trouble. Don't want to forgive him? Don't have to. But if that's the case, draw salt lines along your threshold, on your window sills. Might keep him out. Gotta admit, easy peasy with our powers combined. So, what now? We hit the path? Ride to the nearest notice board? Rustle up another contract? Exactly. Though, effects of the bruise waning, I can feel it. Won't be able to understand you soon. Ah, that's horseshit. I mean, I got so much more I want to tell you, and... Clever beasts, horses. Farewell, Witcher. <laughs>